Hey there, what is going on? This is Rob from Panther Vision. Today I'm going to show you how to blend text in a more structured way. So let's jump in. Okay, so what we're going to need first is uh, the stroke. Right now we're in the fill. I'm going to uncheck the stroke. So click on the none. I'm going to click on the stroke and select the black color. Uh, I'm going to create a circle first. So select the round. What is that? The ellipse tool. Press and hold shift plus alt. Create a circle. From here, we're gonna create some lines. Here is the line tool, line segment tool. Press and hold shift and uh, go here where they intersect. You can see the purple line and just drag it like this by pressing and holding shift. Okay, let's select both of these and just click on the horizontal align center. So this way it aligns it perfectly. I'm gonna press control C and then control F. So we're gonna copy paste another line on top of the line or you can go to edit and hit paste in front and from here I just gonna rotate it from here let's select them all go to the pathfinder and click on the divide if you don't have the pathfinder go to windows and select the pathfinder okay let me see what we've done here I'm gonna right click and on group I'm gonna press shift plus x or you can go here to the little arrow and swap it and from here we can uh, recolor these. I'm gonna select them all, right click and click on group. From here, I'm gonna create a new copy, press and hold alt, drag it and drag it again. So I'm gonna leave with the original one because I need that one. Select these two, go to the object, go to blend and make double click here on the blend tool select specified steps and type in a thousand as you can see it blended perfectly uh, now you're gonna need some uh, drawing skills of course we're gonna because we're gonna select the brush tool and also make sure you're not on this on uh, you're not on the field but you're on the stroke so I'm gonna uncheck the field click on none go to the stroke Select the color. I'm gonna go with black. Let's draw. I'm gonna draw the letter Y. There you go. Okay, I'm gonna increase the size of this. And let's test it out. Select both the, the blend and also the effect. Go to object, click on blend and replace spine okay it's not that bad looking good and you also can for example if you want the front to be in the back and this one in the front you can go to object and go to blend and reverse front to back this way this is going to be in the back and this is going to be on the front i think this way it looks pretty good so yeah that was it thank you so much for watching and uh, if you're new on the channel don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you get notified with daily updates and also check out the other videos as well have a great day. Bye-bye.